Hey guys, welcome back to the Strokeville YouTube channel. For this video, we are going to take a look at this Makita Clone half inch drive impact wrench from Banggood. That's right, you can slap a Makita battery on this sucker and go to town. But first, Banggood was nice enough to send me this item for free so I can make a video showing it to you. They also provided me with a promo code that is good through the end of March. Now at the time, that promo code after shipping brings this down to about $75. You get the impact wrench, you get two batteries and the charger. Now keep in mind when we did the cordless ratchet video, it did sell out and as we got closer to selling out, the price did go up. But for just a little context, you're getting this entire kit after shipping for about $75. The Closest Makita model that is a half inch drive with the friction ring. Bare tool is $239. Bare tool. And when we talk about some of these off brand impact wrenches, one of the main concerns people have is the batteries. If the battery goes bad, if I need another battery, what am I going to do? Well, in this case, you just slap on a Makita battery. If you have a Makita battery and charger, you can use that. If you have other Makita tools, or if you want to get into Makita tools, maybe you already have Makita tools, but you don't want to pay $239 for an impact wrench. You just get theirs instead. It's really cool. We're going to test it out. But let's look at some of the features. Here we have the forward and reverse selector. It is a variable speed switch. This is a brushless motor. The listing says 10 amp hour battery, highly unlikely. I'm assuming they actually mean it's a 5 amp hour battery, but you're getting two of them. That's my guess. There's no real other markings on this thing. It says 288 VF. I think that means like forward voltage or something, but that doesn't mean anything to me. I have no idea. Just like any other tool, battery slides right off the bottom. You have a barrel connector right there for charging. It does come with this charger here that has a 1.5 amp output and it comes with a Euro plug and then they ship you an adapter to go with it. So keep that in mind. Now on the Makita batteries, they have the battery level gauge directly on them, but with the Banggood, it is on this display here. So you can see the green light flashing and we have a couple of different modes. If I get my finger out of the way. See the left light that's coming on and off? So that's when you're in reverse and it'll automatically stop when there's no more resistance on the fastener. Now if I turn it on. So that's by design once there's no more um, resistance and as you can see you can turn it on and off. Now when we put it in the forward position You can see it switches between high and low. And then your battery indicator is right there. So here is that Makita battery. This is a three amp hour. Perfect. Look, it even says LXT on it. From a distance, no one will know. Let's go test this thing out and see how it does. The National Association of Impact Wrench Videos recently decreed that all said videos include a lug nut removal test. So we're at the truck. It's 140 foot pounds. This thing's rated at about 500 foot pounds, so it should be pretty easy. Not as easy as it should have been. Now most lug nuts on vehicles are about 100 foot pounds. So it would take it off. But that took a little more chugga chuggas than I would have liked. So this is a 3 8 drive brushless DeWalt. I retorqued the lug nut. And just for comparison's sake, let's see how this one does. Less chugga chuggas, less. Less. 
Well, we were only about a quarter of a turn away from back to the 140 we had set, so that was pretty good anyway. Test number two. We have a 3 8 inch by 12 inch bolt that we're going to drive into this fallen tree and see what the Makita clone can do with it. Next up, we're going to try the DeWalt 3 8 brushless. And here we go. For giggles, we're going to try the DeWalt High Torque Impact Wrench. <laughs> Broke the bolt. It was on its way to doing it. Just to compare the other two, this is the DeWalt 3 8 drive. We're just shy of 9 inches out. And the bang good, about nine and three quarters. Let's see if it'll take out with the DeWalt put in. I don't think so, Tim. Let's see if it'll take out what it put in. See if the DeWalt will take them out. Okay, let's try that one. Doesn't look like anyone wants to take them out. There it is guys, your Makita clone from Bang Good. If you're interested, there's a link down below with the promo code. Thanks for watching, make sure you give the video a like, subscribe for another subscriber. I'll see you guys next time.